Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode on the new save file. We are jumping in again. We've been just playing around and messing around with modded characters at the minute. We did, um, was it Tainted Andromeda we did last? Unfortunately, I didn't go so well. Uh, this time let's do Tainted Job, because Tainted Job is a bunch of fun. He's a bit of a difficult character, but can be pretty intriguing, so I'm definitely down for it. Um, unfortunately, both of these aren't amazing, but I'll take them both, of course. Uh, but yeah, basically this character gets doubled items all the time, but at the end of every floor loses some of their items. Uh, I think it's 30% of whatever you picked up last floor. Um, so it can be kind of intriguing. You can use this Deus uh, little pocket active here to lock in an item at the cost of obviously 12 charges and at the cost of a broken heart. So... Character's got some intriguing stuff going on, but basically this character's kind of like an ever-changing build. You have your base items that you lock in, and then everything else is just kind of like attached onto your run. I think it's a pretty fun way to um, to play the game, to be honest. I think this character can be really intriguing, so I'm happy to have them on board. To be fair, I don't know why I did that. I could have just pushed them into the spikes like the room intended, but I did not. Range down, love that. Try to be careful here, because um, I don't have a lot of health. You start with very low health as a guy. You're two hits off death. But in a weird way, you got one rotten heart, one half soul heart. So yeah, you, you're two hits off death, but in a strange way. Well, this is an annoying ash room. There's very little space to move. Thank you for the half soul heart there. Nice. Very good damage on him to start. Okay, just just don't spawn three big flies immediately, my guy. A little rude, but there you go. Got that done. And we get ourselves. Um, I think we're just gonna take like both of these as they are. Golden pennies rather nice. Oh, that's a pretty hefty damage down. <laughs> oh lord. Health up's nice. But yeah, that damage down was uh aggressive. So that puts us in a not great spot for next floor. We have 2.25 damage. Um, we're going to need a damage up pretty goddamn soon. Otherwise, things are going to be a little rough. Unless it takes it away from us, which of course it wouldn't. Um, but yeah, we're probably going to notice some rather rough damage situations for a little bit here. As for the question of the day, um, generally, I, I, I think I'm going to make a video about this soon. But I, I'd like some feedback on... This is my question of the day. I'd like some feedback on what series and games I should be playing on the channel. Because I'll admit, over the past few weeks, I've been I've been slacking a little bit with YouTube. I've not been uploading a series other than Isaac as, as regularly as I should be. I've, I've like stopped uploading on the weekends and stuff. Just the weekend thing I might continue doing because it's been nice not having an additional series on the weekend recently. It gives saves me a bit of time and it means that if, I've, if I'm busy over the weekend, I've only got to worry about Isaac, which is rather nice so i might keep on with that but in general like during the week obviously i've been doing voidigo uh into the gungeon but I'd, I'd like to know from you guys what series that i've previously done that you'd like to see more of or series that um i haven't done before that you'd like to see me start i think I'd, it'd be intriguing to hear what you guys want to see from that right let's uh take out this guy that okay does dr shrimmer is dr shrimmer based off of your damage because that was pathetic levels of damage. Like, I've never seen Dr. Shremert do such little damage before. What was that about? So, a bit, a bit annoyed at that. Ended up hitting myself with it as well, just to add insult to injury. Okay. Remember that you can go spectral here, so we've got to be wary of that. Luckily, this guy isn't too bad, unless he does his triple shot, which he doesn't do very often, but... It's going to take us a while to kill him, so he has the opportunity. Oh, there you go. That's a triple shot. Luckily, he shot them into the mushrooms there. It didn't do much. Okay, we're all good. Took a little while, but we got there. We don't know what we're getting here, so we'll just take them both as is. Pretty happy with both of them, so it's going to be annoying when I have to say goodbye to them. We're going to get Angel Deal here as well, I think. Right. Our tears are tiny, our damage is low, but our fire rate is now pretty good. Yeah, I, I, Dr. Fetus must be based on your damage, Dr. Fetus. Um, Dr. Remert, sorry. Must be um, based on your damage, because that was pathetic. Like, I've never seen it do such low damage before. Terrible usage of it. 
Extra bomb there, thank you. And in here, Leo and Balrog's head. I Okay, yeah, there you go. Um dealing 20 times damage. So it only dealt like 20 it only dealt like 40 damage. That's pretty pathetic. And then this, which does 50 damage. Yeah, this is just better right now. It does flat damage. Let's take this. Right. Let's skedaddle skadoodle. Probably gonna lose both of our fire air items rather than mum's suppository. Um trying to just sort of suss out what I wanna do here. I've got Leo, I feel like I might as well try and utilize it a little bit here. We get rid of those guys. Yeah, I gotta say, Leo might be disappearing soon, so why not make the most of it? Yeah. We can try and go to the shop maybe as well, we've got enough money for it. Oh god, don't know why I didn't get out of the way for either of those hits there, that was really stupid. The these bees, to be fair, really wig me out. They move in very peculiar ways. Okay, thanks. Thanks for that little poop there that I accidentally stood on with Leo. Great stuff. Didn't mean to do that, but there you go. That heart makes me feel better. But now it means that angel deal is in jeopardy unless we can buy a soul heart here. Let's see what the game offers us. We've got an active item there. We'll just buy the soul heart. Nothing from there. Right, okay. Keep it going. Secret room. Do we have any inkling on where secret room might be? Not really. I'm not going to worry about it. Right. Away we go. See what we end up losing on the next floor. But yeah, like I said, I might make a, 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 a dedicated video for it about like what I should be at. So Leo's gone. Lemonhead's gone. Dude, take away the fucking suppository. Please. It's getting really annoying that the one item that's making us super weak it won't fucking take away. Oh my god. God damn it, game. God damn it. Right, we do have at least have a soul heart now. Very displeased with my current damage. Oh dude, this is this is brutal. This guy won't stop firing. And I can't bloody get in there because I don't have enough damage. Dude, stop firing. There you go. Getting a bit ridiculous. At least we've got this head for doing good damage. Just poof that guy out of existence. Tinted rock there as well. I see you. Come on, this floor needs to be a lot better. Needs to be a lot, lot better. Oh my god, two hits to kill these mushroom guys. This is pathetic. This is not a good run to start with. Should not have taken the suppository without any damage ups. That was a terrible idea. It's one of those items that it can be so goddamn good, but if you get it without any damage ups, it's literally like run ruining. Also, I'll tell you what is run ruining. All these fucking bubbles lagging the shit out of my game. <laughs> Like, with every second that goes by in this room, the frame rate just gets worse and worse. Right, thank you. It eventually sorted itself out. Got three stone chests in here. One of them just disappeared. I don't even have a bomb, so that's... Shit on that parade. Bugger you with your fucking stupid shits. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> I'm very frustrated right now. Also, what the hell cursed um, thingy room could that be? Is that going to be Leo? Is that going to be that bullshit Leo again? Because I had Leo at the start of this floor. It is, isn't it? I have to check. But that item is the w worst item to ever exist. Ever. It's not, okay. It's just number one. Which is strange. Um... Hmm. I think I'm going to lock this in. And then I'm going to take this. 
Obviously, my range is now pretty poopy. But having max fire rate instantly is kind of nice. Gimpy. Oh, and an active item. That's great. Thanks for that. Yeah, I'm not particularly enthused about this run at all. Unless it gets rid of Mum's Suppository and gives me a bunch of damage upgrades, I'm not going to be happy. Simple as. <laughs> it's shrimple as that. Because at the minute, this is pain. This is true pain. At least we've got high fire rate now, but... We have to send point blank to things, and it still takes forever to fucking kill them. Oh, you get out of here, you. What's this even meant to be? I don't get it. Is it a frog? Like, what, what is that thing? Looks like a defective birth. I have no idea what to think of it. Don't have a key for my goddamn shop either. Lovely. Oh my god. I keep generating a black heart, then instantly utilizing it. Right, boss time. Not having damage between rooms with my um, my book or whatever is kind of annoying, I've got to say. Dude, please die. Just stay in there, there you go. Right, boss time with no bombs and stuff. This is going to be a really rough boss fight, I think. Remember, I take double damage on this guy as well. I don't know what you're doing right now, my la my lad. No oh, bugger. I like to keep my angel deal, but literally, this run, nah, 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 nah. This run is so trash. I hate it. Can I restart? Can we have a do-over, please? I've been fighting this guy for six years, and he's like, still got full hits. Just, just kill me. Just let me restart. Just, just do over. This run's trash. <laughs> Never take Mum's suppository at base damage. That's just not fun. <laughs> not fun at all. Wow. You see, this is what happens. I end my streak and then immediately I'm just terrible at the game again. I mean, to be fair, that was just... That was just the game kind of screwing me over a little bit there. It just takes away all my items apart from the one specific item I'm like, please get rid of. Good, good. I'll take a gamble on a pill. Range up. Yeah, it's better than last time with our range down. Good, good. Yeah, we do have uh, petrified poop right now, so we can get a good bit out of that. Calm yourself, dashing poop. It sounds like I'm calling him handsome. Like, he's very dashing. No, I'm not. Sticky nickel, how dare you. Right. We've got Mum's contacts in here. Continuum. Um. Hmm. I think Mum's contact is worth keeping. Continuum I don't particularly care about. Mum's contact is just pretty good. Yeah, Mum's contact. Freezing is pretty nice. Stop throwing your head at me, Gooba. Judgment. Temperance. If I get a bomb, I can bomb him, I guess. At least uh, Continuum gives us Spectral. That's rather nice. I always forget about that. Let's not get hit here if we can. Never has someone actually used Continuum this way before. Never been done. Ooh, HP up. That's rather nice. Okay, unfortunately, a cube of meat is coming our way now, which I do not approve of. Do not approve of at all. At least the freezing's helping out here, too. <sighs> but yeah, it just feels like one of those days on Isaac. It's probably going to be for a little while while I'm playing the modded characters before we get back to doing streaks. I do want to do, like, an Eden streak or something, but I know that a lot of people do find those boring. But I quite enjoy them. It also means makes my thumbnails worse. <laughs> So it doesn't work well for my thumbnails. But there you go. There's him done. Right. You should take Continuum out of all of these things. Right. Down to the next floor. Feeling a lot, lot more positive with this run. 
I knew it would fucking take Continuum. And my damage up. Oh, why did you leave me with Ball of Bandages? No one has ever enjoyed Ball of Bandages. It's terrible. It used to be pretty good, and then they, like, nerfed it into the ground. For those of you that don't know, in Repentance, they changed how familiars, uh, contact familiars deal damage. Basically, they, they massively lowered their tick rates, so they deal damage way less often. And it made most of them significantly worse. Like, Ball of Bandages and, and Cube of Meat used to be pretty goddamn strong, and now they're, like, just very meh. Like, they're not worth using for damage anymore, they're just, like, worth using to block shots, and that's pretty much it. See all these freezing shots? I'm popping off with them. Popping off, right. What we got going on in here? Uh, snake and $3 bill, I think that is. Yeah. Happy to just grab both of those. $3 bill I'd kind of prefer to keep, but we've not got a charge right now. I don't know if we're going to get one this floor. Snake's decent, but not amazing. Got number one going on now. Hick. And triple shot to end it off. Lovely. And then we've got, don't know what that is, Jesus Juice, and then that's uh, Cracker Jacks, yep. Using an active item has a chance to trigger one of the following effects. Nah, just rather have to ride poop right now, to be honest. I don't want to go Devil Deal yet again here. Let's keep it moving. See what we lose. You watch it be another damage upgrade. Yeah, Snake. Damn it, Snake's still about, though. He's still here? No, not anymore. We'll probably lose $3 bill soon. Nice to have it for now, but I'm sure it'll... Send its way off very soon. Good kill there, good kill. I always get these rocks confused with tinted rocks, because they've got that green tint to them. Ow, I don't think I've ever been hit by one of these frogs before. Don't like where you're situated, my ladder. Oh god, you're so hard to hit. There you go, we got him. Extra keys is really nice. But yeah, items so far are decent. Only having Mum's contact locked in so far isn't ideal, obviously. Ooh, damn, we got the perfect, the perfect tier modifier there. I wish I could get Eye of Belial for real. Fire mind going off. Got all of some fire mind explosions in the house. We do have, um, Deus Custodia ready once again. Oh my god. Rooms are making it really annoying to kill things. Extra bomb there as well. Oh, no. We got these guys. Is that one a champion or feared? Okay, he's feared. Really hard to tell there, because obviously with $3 bill, I'm just getting effects, like, so randomly. Oh, dude. Such a bad hit. <laughs> it's because it curves. The shots are, like, curly. It threw me off. All right, let me go back and get that bomb real quick. At least we've still got half a soul heart protecting our uh, potential angel deal, of which we'll definitely not get this floor, even though I'm desperate for it. Okay, here's our item room. I bugger you. Oh god, there's two of them. Oh my god, this room's so long. Why? Bugger shot in there, nice. And we get Bob's Brain, which I'm sure we'll end up keeping for ages, and Pinhead. Pinhead's worth keeping, I think, but I'm gonna just quickly go and make sure I don't get, like, a really good angel deal first. Oh, God. These dudes just shot, fired so many goddamn shots, it's insane. Yeah, I just don't want to make sure I don't get, like, a really good angel deal first that I want to lock in. It would really suck to not have Deus Custodia available if that happened. Unfortunately, there's apparently a ton of rooms between me and the, uh, boss fight. Dude, these, like, look at them. There's way too many shots. Come on now.
Oh, for fuck's sake. Almost lost my uh, angel deal chance and one hit off. Why was there so many rooms between me and victory here? Oh my god. Okay, right, let's see if we can do it. Ooh, it's good that we got, um, what's it called? Whiz shot to start this out. Right. We're doing okay here. Okay. We didn't get the angel deal, of course. Level 2 on that. Stem cell. And we'll go and Discordia uh, Pinhead. Dis Deus Custodia. Discordia. I mean, that kind of works. Discordia. It kind of fits. Soul Heart in here. No, but we did get a Humbling Bundle, which is pretty good. I'd rather, like, keep it, but I'll just take it for now. Yeah, keep that latched on to us, because it gives us piercing, which is pretty goddamn good. And... Attaching the enemies together, on certain enemies it can be very, very strong, and in general it's just nice. Anyways, let's keep moving. Who you calling Pinhead? Right. Okay, so famine, and what does it take from us this time? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, that was... Of all the things it could have taken, they were literally both of the best ones it could have taken. We were looking to get rid of Bob's brain. I basically only took it as fodder to, to be getting rid of. Humbling bundle being useful for us here. There's the soul heart to protect that angel deal. Let's hope it does. You need to bugger right off. Good, good. You have been buggered off. Ugh, God damn it, I hate that room so much. <laughs> I'm so bad at avoiding that room. I, I didn't set off in time. Ooh, our range is pretty good. We're able to shoot across most of this room. Beautiful. Oh, give me some spiders. Give me some spiders. This guy has so much health. What the hell? Hopefully we can get a lot from Humbling Bundle before we have to like say goodbye to it. Oh, you big bastard. You big shit. We lost our soul heart already. I can tell this is the way to the boss. But I'm still not very confident right now. Especially not with these shits doing their thing. Extra bombs. I'm definitely going to bomb the hell out of the boss, whatever it is. Can't believe that. God damn it. I was like, okay, this guy's going to laser me. I've got to just avoid it. Of course, I stood right in it. If, if I don't get this on an 18% chance, I'm going to cry. Although, I'll probably get hit by this guy a bunch of times. This is a, a boss that I'm not a particularly big fan of. You're charmed. Why do you just not attack me? Come on. 18% chance, please. You bastard. You bastard of the game. That's a lot of keys, baby. That's a lot of keys. Alright, let's try and keep this goddamn soul heart alive this time. I'm getting a bit annoyed. Good, good. We are bl uh, blitzing through rooms, though, so... In that regard, we're doing reasonably well. Good. Oh, for God's sake, I didn't realize it was these guys. This might be my one of my least favorite enemies in the entire game. Like, not only does it have a mechanic I hate of making you wait to attack them, but also the three burn shot they do is very frustrating. And also, they move incredibly quickly. They just encompass a lot of things I hate about certain enemies. 
But that's not expected, but I'll take it. Okay, actually go and collect the money before we do anything, because otherwise he'll just take it all. I've got Cricket's head for right now. Lovely. Right. We got a lot of money out of that. This is what I mean about, basically, I don't really mind if we lose, um... If we lose, what's it called at this point? Humbling Bundle, because we've gained a ton out of it so far, so... I'd like to keep it, but if we do lose it, it won't be devastating, is what I'm saying. Is this secret room above me here? It looks like it could be. It's not? Wow, okay. Looks very similar to... Where's our item room? God damn. Make me jump through all sorts of hoops. Ugh. Oh god, this room's annoying. I wanted to keep my goddamn soul heart alive. Why you give me these rooms, man? Why's my item room got to be so damn far away? This is pretty good if we can manage to get a book. This is a really good trinket. Also, that's a lot of pennies. I guess I could go Stephen Floor. It might be a good idea. Stephen Floor might not be a bad idea at all. And there's our item room, finally. Wow. Um, I guess I'll take both. Right. Let's go to Stephen Floor, shall we? Why not? Actually, no. Stephen Floor's bad because we don't get an item room in Stephen Floor, which means we get less items overall. So I think it's not a good idea. Pause I've taken for God knows what reason. It's just an active. I didn't have one. I don't really think... Okay. Do you know what? No. Eh. Yeah, do you know what? No. I'm going to go through this room and out of this way because I think it's easier. Yeah, way easier. You can set off before they even start shooting. I'm looking for a half soul heart in one of those. Sadly, I didn't get it. Is this secret room? It is. <gasps> Holy. Okay, so... Ordinary life is tears up spawn additional mom dad related item in treasure rooms. We've only got one treasure room left. I'm pretty sure uh, we've got two technically. Um, so we'll take that and then we'll suck that up because we want to keep echo chamber in the loop. Right down we go. Good old echo chamber. That was a, a worthwhile secret room right there. Very worthwhile indeed. Right, let's see what it steals from us. Do it take ordinary life, please. Okay, it didn't. Eh, we lost some we lost some bad stuff there. We'd have rather have lost Bumbo. But ordinary life, I think, could be kind of glitchy in a good way. You'll see what I mean in a sec. Yes. Exactly. It spawned a mum item, which spawned in turn an additional item. So we got four items instead of two. Shoot the whip is definitely better than that. So ordinary life is pretty good. Right. What we got going on in here? A burn heart. And a death card. Kind of a strange room there. Just having a burn heart in it. Death card will be looped into our echo chamber, which is rather nice. What do I do with you? I'm just gonna wait for you to fire all your babies. Yes, I do. You are dead. Oh, there's a door down here. I didn't even see that. Get shooped. Still haven't lost Humbling Bundle yet either, which is nice. Oh, dude, every time I don't need it to do fucking whiz shot, it does whiz shot. It's always at the worst timing. I, sh I really would have been nice to lock in Deadeye 
I maybe should have thought of that. But that is very, very good. Oops, I guess. Oh, that was nice. That was very nice. That creep does hurt me, right? I'm pretty sure it does. Pill. HP up. Oh, we're going to get a bunch of HP ups here. Which actually isn't good for us, unfortunately. That's that's bad. Now we can't hold soul heart health. I've been screwed there. Taking pills, blind pills, is a bit of a risk with... Uh, with what's it called? Echo chamber. But I knew what I was signing up for. Ooh. Squeezy. And I saw. Can, can we not with all of the invincible ones, please? I'm having a really hard time here. There you go. Child leash doesn't matter too much for us, I don't think. Thinking she is, no thank you. Excuse me, die, thank you. Took you long enough, my ladder. Oh, bugger, I didn't see you there. And this guy's feared. Stop being feared. I should bomb this, right? It's worth it. Yeah, that was totally worth it. Oh, dude, I'm going to miss Deadeye when it eventually gets taken away from me. Making us so strong right now. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Nine volt here. Okay, nine volt's definitely a contender for sucking up. Um, I need to go to my boss first and see if there's an angel deal that's better suited, though. Because there might well be. I need more base damage is what I need. Like, I'm literally at 3.5 base damage. Oh my god, this room is overwhelming. There's no way I'm going to fucking get my angel deal here. Dude! Dude, fuck you! This is so overwhelming! There's too much going on! My angel deal, again! This is why I don't like Fiendfolio bosses. They're just too much, man. They're just too much. Right, give me that. Um, excuse me? Why can't I? Oh, there you go. Lock that in. Yeah, it just, it just... There's too much going on. Right, anyways, down to the next floor. Humbling bundle finally gone. Oh no, not dead eye. Okay, that has put us in a rough spot because this uh, my active is the whole reason that I uh, I went for nine volt there, and unfortunately with the damage that we're currently on, it's not as effective. Um, it's still good as you can see, but not as effective as it should be. Oh god. Lost that angel deal again. Very, very nice. I'm just accepting that I'm never getting an angel deal. I've just... I've come to terms with that now. I'm never getting an angel deal. I'm never getting a damager. It is a sad, sad story, but it is a true one. Oh my god, die already. Oh, come on, I hate it when you go all the way to the boss and you miss the shop, you miss the item room, miss everything. It's so annoying. Good. Get rid of that guy very quickly. Sack room I could definitely be tempted to play. Oh god, this is a bit of an awful room here. Not too bad, actually. Not too bad. 
Okay, Eve's Mascara, I need. And Butt Bombs, even though I fire right now is pretty bad. Our damage is so much better now. Oh, wow. Kind of funny to get both of those at once. Okay. Um, sack room. Do we have any way to play sack room, really? Because it would be nice. Okay, we have some hearts there. That's good. Let's see if we can get some hearts out of the arcade as well. And then think about playing it. Because I very much would like to. Hello. Break the egg. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, so... I can't, Rosary, unfortunately, doesn't heal me at all, which is a shame. Dude. Dude. What the fuck? How many failures in a row was that? That's insane. Fuck you. That blew up both, neither of you. Okay, great. Fuck you, machine. And you. Soul heart there. We literally can't pick it up. <sighs> that was very frustrating to see. Okay. Right. Oh, the re-fucking genning rocks. This curse can be such bollocks sometimes. Half red heart that I didn't mean to pick up. Would it be nice to uh, keep that around? Okay, so let's see. Oh, thanks for that, Greg. Thanks for that. Right, okay, let's see. So we've currently got... Um, eight hearts, we need seven players. I could take a gamble on it, it'd be a risk, but I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. I just wanna have some more intrigue in this run, and hopefully the sack room can give me an angel deal I've been so desperately missing out on. Okay, there's the angel deal at least, although not a particularly good one, I've got to admit. Don't know why I did that, I can't get the soul hearts, stupid. Right, to the next floor. That didn't go too well either. Okay, we got we got angel deals. Unfortunately, not great ones. Teeth might be able to give us more angel deals. We'll see. That's why I took it, but eh, not confident. I'm not confident. Anyhow, to the next floor. Actually, this we still got the boss yet. I forgot about that. I completely mistimed my shoop there. Oops. Shoop to oops. Oh, god damn. I don't know what happened there, but you took a lot of damage. We'll take that. Right, next floor. Let's see what we lose. Oh, we got an angel teleport, like, straight away this time. Okay, so... I think we... I think at this point we Days Custodia that. And... We lost our active, which is a pain in the ass. Um, I don't know how this is going to work, but I'm going to take it anyways. Oh, okay. It does do something. So this one is nothing. This one... Oh, wait. These are all, like... 
Okay, let's let's just try them all out. Okay, so this one's really low damage, not very valuable. Do not do not like this room so far either, gotta say. There's just shit everywhere. Yeah, good. That was a horrible room. Right. So I think we want I think we want red. So far, I'm pretty much regretting my decision of taking this as our main weapon. It doesn't seem to be doing very well. Greg. Greg. I'm sorry, but you're not going to get any of my respect if you keep just, just giving me troll bombs and nothing else. You've got to know that, right? You've got to know that. A pill. I'll take the gamble. Lemon juice. Oh, dude. Thought I could hit that guy. Apparently not. I'll get the charge up time on this. <laughs> not even remotely worth. Oh, dude, I'm gonna die. I mean, I don't care. These runs are all about dying. I'm having some fun with being able to die for a little while. Oh, God. I didn't know it was that type of hand. There you go. We died again. Uh, I'm probably gonna have, like, quite a lot of deaths in a row here before we get back on track. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.